Hello, kings, queens, nerds, and geeks. Powdered Milk here, and welcome to Upper Tale, the unofficial fan game. The unofficial sequel to... To, uh, sorry. The unofficial sequel to Undertale. And it's a fan game, obviously. And, um... It's, it seems to be... has been finished. And apparently the creator didn't like the game. And I figured, you know what? Let's try to give this game more credit than it's due. And, like... I think this is also made by the same guy who is making Don't Forget and the multiplayer um, Undertale. So, um, of course, the uh, normal controls is arrow keys, Z, X, and Alt Enter is the window thing. So, okay, um, of course. Okay, sorry, I had to click this, click the game. Howdy, I'm Flowey, Flowey the Flower. Hey, I don't need to do that intro for you again, do I? Are you going back Ak here? Didn't your happy ending satisfy you enough? You got exactly what you want. So what you need to come back. But if you really want to see your friends again, go ahead. But, but, don't think I'm going to be ni any nicer. Just because you are kind to me in, the tr in my true form doesn't mean I'll slight you now. You're still an idiot. But anyway, you can... Go now. Have fun. What, no? <laughs> Whatever. Looks inside the closet. It's full of stri- I've clothes. It's- It's just a lamp. Looks outside and everything is on fire. Just kidding, everything looks normal. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> it's locked locked okay um i don't think i'll really edit this one as much because i love undertale good morning my child i hope you slept well i am taking making butterscotch cinnamon pie for you all and all of your friends today it'll take make a while so in the meantime perhaps you should go outside and play have fun okay can't interact with these can I interact with this? No. Okay. Let's just go. Okay. As I just said, guys, this is made by the same guy who made Don't Forget. So, this is kind of going on the same basic play style. Oh, hi, Frisk. Do you think it might want to come over sometime? Okay. How about tomorrow? Okay, bye. Oh, poor nap. Door's locked. You hear some spooky music coming from the inside. I like the music that's playing in the background. The door is locked. You hear endless barking coming from it. Ah, it's Toby Fox! Ah, I get the joke. The door is locked, but you hear some shout top of the morning to your laddies on the other side. <laughs> Jacksepticeye! Okay, let's live in here. The door is locked, but you hear someone slowly top. Ipe away on their laptop. Okay. There's a poor... They are pouring their hearts and soul to whatever they are doing. They're pushing themselves away from friends and family. That's the life I chose. Huh? Get back. What are you doing? I'm guessing that's Alphys or something in reference to the creator. The door is locked, but you can hear some shouts ah! on the other side. I'm guessing that's, um... Oh, wait, that's Elvis. So that's the creator's reference. Okay. Uh, so wait. So I'm guessing this is um, Undyne. Here's Elvis. Hey, Frisk. Good morning. I just standing here enjoying the sunlight. It feels great. And well, uh, catch you later. <laughs> the door is locked. There's sounds of uh, coming from the other side. door is locked. You can hear music and some saying, oh, ye oh, yes, on the other side. Okay, that's Metaton, one of my favorite characters, guys. Metaton is one of my favorites. He's so fabulous! Okay. Oh, God. I love Metaton. Undertale pushes my buttons in many ways in one. Hello. Why, hello there, Frisk. <clears throat> I hope you are having a pleasant day. I'm just tending to these wonderful flowers. 
Uh, aren't they just beautiful? I better get back to them. I suppose I shall see you later. Oh, um, of course, this is the house that's supposed to be just like the one they have back at Snowden. This is the house in Sansa Papyrus. It seems that there's still snow on it. I guess they are too lazy to get it off. Oh well. Okay. Uh, we're not gonna go to the fields, we're gonna go the opposite direction. Okay, I can't read it. I guess it just says beach. Papyr! Hey, Frisk! Have you seen Sans? He's always slacking off. He needs to look after the hu for humans. Oh, wait. We don't need to do that anymore, do we? Sorry. Just need to get used to saying that. Okay, I guess we don't need to do that. Be over here. Uh, let's just go to the field. Alright, actually, there's probably other parts of this game I haven't seen yet. Let's go kill a little back. I, before I want to continue, I want to explore everything in the game. <gasps> Ooh, there's more. Let's go up. Oh, wait. Hey, look, it's Grilby! It's Grilby's. You're not hungry right now, though. Ah, you made it where I couldn't go into Grilby's. But Grilby's is awesome. What's this? The library, the misspelled name. The, it's the library, or library. It's, it seems to be closed. You look up and notice that there's still snow on the building. I guess there were too late AC to take it off. <laughs> Why is there still snow on the building? Hey, it's Papyrus' head. Oh my God. Uh... Hey, look, it's Monster Kid. Yo, what's up? There's some school, to, no school today, so they're just hanging around. See you later. I'm guessing this is the school? It's locked. Wish there was a way to run, but there's no running in Undertale, so I'm guessing that's not gonna happen. <laughs> Sorry guys, I just kinda woke up earlier. I just noticed that there's random patches of, flat, of um, buttercups around. So we're just gonna go to the field. Oh look! Got caution. Recently, monsters have been wandering in this tall grass. If you come across them, please act and use, then use mercy. A random sparkling object fills you with determination. Your uh, aisle has been saved. Frog it! Frog it! Start every encounter. Enters an attack. Act. Frog it, talk. You talk to Frog it. It doesn't understand or has been delighted anyway. Okay. I like how where it says um, spare, uh, flee, it says get the fuck out. Fuck! You encountered Mishum. He is frightened and it and, and obey, and may, and attack you. Act with um, Console. You tell Rosam that everything is alright. It seems less nervous. Oh shit! I just noticed I have 20. Okay, I thought it was 25 health, sorry. Okay, I get zero gold for that shit, okay. Oh, oh hey, uh, how's it going? I've been standing here, looking for less beautiful trees. The wo woods have expected them to be so. I would have expected them to be so interesting, but just can't stop up staring at them. I just stumbled by. I think these trees really spruced up the place. Uh, anyway, wanna go grillies? It should be open. Come on, let's go to my my tree. Nice. <clears throat> At least we're here at Groovies, and it's still the same as it was. Hey, I want to chat about, some, about something. And when I was standing around back there, I wasn't really there to, for the trees. Don't get me wrong. The trees are great, I guess. But I really was go doing some thinking. What were you thinking, Sans? What were you thinking? That's what I want to know, is what the fuck were you thinking? No, 
I really out of the blue, but I was thinking about the timeline. And we've noticed that we've jumped up left, we've been jumping left and right, stopping and starting. So, uh, you wouldn't happen to know anything about this one. Yes. You do? Yeah, I, it was pretty confusing what's happening. So, I, 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 that was a very sincere question. This is just like when you at, when he asked you, do you know of a talking flower? Because you didn't know, because when you first play, you don't know what he's talking about. You, you assume he knows about Flowey. But he was referring to the, to the Echo Flowers. And hopefully that, everything is going to be great. Whatever, whatever, or whoever is causing it will, will stop. At least I hope they do. Well, now that's out of the way, do you want anything? No? You sure? Alright then. You can go now. Just, just want to order some ketchup. I'm just going to order some ketchup. Sorry guys, I'm having a little trouble. Speaking. Hey Groovy, one bottle of ketchup please. Put it on the table. Everyone just loves the fact he just loves consuming ketchup. Hmm. Outfit. Uh, hi, Frisk. I was wondering if you'd like to come over to my house. I needed to test something for me. It's a really important. Uh, come on, no time to waste. All right. Welcome to my home. It's, so the thing is, I wanted you to test my new lab, otherwise known as the base, my basement. Come on in. Random sparkling object fills you with determination. Your file has been saved. Okay. I can't go in. It's locked. I can't. I can't read these. Oh my God! But it's a poster. Oh yes. Oh look, it's the computer. Still piled with anime. Why is there still a chainsaw? I'm guessing that's a T thing. Oh, so the thing I need you to test S is the time machine. I made it so we could discover more about the past and uh Oh, who am I kidding? I made it because I saw all the whole move I saw in a movie. Anyway, I was wondering you like the first uh, first ever time traveler. It should be safe. Okay Uh you can choose your destination, but be careful to, tr to mess with anything or bump into anything in the path itself. Okay, go on. Let's go to Snowden! Wait, this is just after... Random sparkling object fills your determination, however, saving ass is probably not a good idea. Is this place made the same way? <gasps> you don't really want to look at the picture again. Okay, they're they're really making this big time. The best is not to mess with the stuff. Probably not so useful anyway. Huh? Who's following? Oh, it's you. I could have sworn you were already a couple of rooms ahead. Oh well, it doesn't matter. I'll be up ahead and see you. Perhaps you should go back to the time machine. You might run into some past selves if you continue. Okay, that's interesting. That's pretty cool! I love this! This gives you the concept of more time travel. That means you'll run into your past self, the one who hasn't met, been to the area you're in. So that says a lot. Can I go? What? Okay, I just glitched. Okay. How? Wow. Frisk, you did it. You're officially the world's first time traveler. That's amazing. Uh, well, I feel like traveling back in time and place if you want. If you're finished doing that, come back and talk to me. I have something I need you to do for me. Have fun and make sure you're not a S to anything. Let's go to the waterfall. I want to see what the waterfall is like. Oh! Hey. Nothing, they have nothing to say, probably because Ricky G can't be bothered to be put to you, unique dialogue in these things. <laughs> so I'm not gonna bother reading those! Ricky G, by the way, guys, the, is the creator of the game. And, um, what I'm trying to do is just trying to figure out. 
Once again, Ricky just too bit like, easy to put this in. How do you not notice I just came back? See, you see your past house having a concert with the siren. You decide that it's best not to continue your past house to, to see you. So. Let's try talking to him. There's no way to, for me, you to get out of this place. I'm stuck here. But it's okay, you hear? Undyne will fix everything, you hear? I'll be happy again, you hear? Someday. I'm gonna go now. Ah! Uh, don't make me sad! Ah! One of the ducks nearby. Surprised there's no monsters fucking with me right now. For some reason, this music is more intense than it should be. And let's go to Hotline. <gasps> we just saw ourselves going through here. Why are we following ourselves? Can't go up there. Can we go here? There's no point of going anywhere else. You should stay in the, in the time machine. What well, is Hotland? You can't find your way. <gasps> this is where you met at Sands and Grillbees. This is where they were at Grill. You decide to see the batty and caddy just in case you passed up. Oh, can't go that way. They just put an invisible wall. Wonder, can you go here? <gasps> you can! This is where you met, uh, Metaton. Where, uh, this is one of the things that Metaton gets you to do. <gasps> Gaster! Gaster! Gaster was here! Does that mean that Gaster was in other places? Uh, it's too late to find out now. Now that it's done. I found Gaster. Again! Somewhere. I found a, a hint of Gaster somewhere. That means he's aware that I'm doing something. Hi, Frisk. Are you ready to do something for me? Yes. Uh, okay, great. So, uh, the thing I wanted you to do is. Um, do you remember when we all went to get Asgore's castle and stop up you Asgore from fighting in a certain part where Undyne and I were about to, you know, what I was I talking about, right? I want you to take a picture of that moment for me. Just like a peek into the room and take a quick pic with your phone or something. And then immediately come back. What? Why aren't you doing this? You're, this my, am I doing this myself? Well, I, uh, I probably squeal or something and draw attention to myself. <laughs> eh. So, sh you should do it. However, if it, you happen to run into someone that, from your past, and they see you the machine, abort the mission entirely and try to get back home as soon as possible, okay? Everything will be fine, I think. Get in the time machine, we will take you straight into Asgore's castle. I really do not want to know what happens next. This- I have a bad feeling about this. <laughs> that idiot. I'm there, that stupid king right now. How that- Now's my chance to become a god. No one can stop me. Huh? How did you- When did you- But you're in there. But the king- With the king- What is that- That machine? Hang on. You're- if you're here and in there, you must be a time machine. Wait, what? With the time machine, I could, I could save Kara. Everything could go back to the way it used to be. No, but you, you're in my way again. This time, however, you won't be so lucky. Now die. Probably from the pa ass attacks you. Perhaps you should keep talking. 
Flowey from the past, talk. You tell Flowey what the f what other is nice today, he rolls his eyes. Nice try, Flowey. Flowey from the... Not like you can actually hit me, Flowey. Wait, why did I hit him? Why did I hit him? No. Oh, no. Act. Okay, okay, I'm running a little on things. I don't have any items. Flowey from the past, talk. Fuck! I die. Okay, we're gonna try this again, because I already died once. Oh shit. Ah! Fuck, quit hitting me! I gotta figure this out. Ah! He's hitting me. He's getting annoyed now. You can tell he's getting annoyed now. Okay. Okay. Act flowey, come on, talk. Come on, aren't you getting, going to fight? Then you can't possibly expect to spare. Everyone you meet, you're such an idiot. Wait, that stupid old lady is coming. I can't let her see me. I'll be back. My child, whatever you're doing in out here, I ha thought you were with Asgore. Well, never mind. Anyway, I was first going to let you go this journey alone, but I would not, not stop worrying. Your adventure must have been so treacherous. Oh no! Everyone's seeing me! Oh no, I fucked up time. I fucked up time. I can't read this. Hey, what's up, guy? My voice. No! I fucked up everything too early! Stop! Talking, I have to... Okay, I get it. You're happy to see me. I, I I get it. I'm trying to get you. Fuck me up, everybody. Ah! Not again. You're kidding. Oh god, he's doing the same shit he did in the first game, in the original game. Um, of course. Of course. Hold on. Guys, be, I'll be right there. If it's doing what I think it's doing. Okay, hold on. Huh? How are you still here? You should be gone. It's probably the only matter of time before you are erased forever. Oh. You think you can defeat beat me? That's funny. You've got seven. I've got seven human souls. All all monster souls. That's equivalent to eight human souls. And I'm eight times more powerful than you. You can't stop me. Not even your determination can help you now. But if it, but hey, if you want to fight, I won't say no. Are you ready? Uh, I actually have to physically fight Flower. Oh no! But it it refused. You meaning I can't lose? Ah! Ah, 
son of a bitch! I keep dying! But I refuse. It means I can't die at this point. I found a glitch. Oh shit. Oh shit. I got one HP. Oh shit! Well, okay, but it refused. I like how. Okay, his attacks are pretty similar. Just gotta find their area. Fuck! Oh shit. You're really not good at raining those, are you? Just sit over here. Stay right here. I'll be safe. Ah, shit! I didn't see that coming. Okay, but LL uh, Flowey's almost dead anyway. Of course. That means the original Frisk is dead. Uh, explosions. It's a time machine. <laughs> it's officially okay. I I'm sorry, guys. I'm skipping through these. I just like really, we really feeling weird on this. So now the time has been changed. That's awesome. Hey, I heard an explosion. What's going on? Oh, hey, Sans. What's the explosion? It came from my t machine over here. Time machine. Frisk is the world's first ever time traveler. Time traveler. <laughs> hey, Frisk. Do you mind if you have a chat in private? I need to talk to you. Come on. Let's go. So, you can travel back in time now. Huh? That's cool. This is this is getting intense, but um, keep this in mind when you go back again. I've had her really taken away it, it from me so many times. I gave up trying to go back a long time ago. But being on the surface with all these friends, this is the farthest uh, I've g ever gotten. And I hate to have lose all this. You understand, right? Of course you do. So whenever you time travel, make sure you're not to accidentally mess with anything. Because even with the tiniest little detail, it can change everything. Gee, that sounds like some um, awful fan game about uh, time travel. Good thing we're not in anything like that. You had to be that meta! You had to be that meta! Every fan game they play gets meta. Ah, uh, right? Hey. Yeah. Oh hey, I got a text. It's from Tori. Uh, it says that the pie is ready and we should be getting over. Well, I'm pretty much set at all I wanted to say. Just keep all in mind, alright? Well, I'm pretty hungry. The last time I ate was so long ago. A whole five minutes. Come on, pal, let's go.
You and Sans go home and everything is here. All you eat is pie and have a good time. You can't help but think about what you've done. Since you've changed the timeline, you'll never you'll never get to go owe to Azrael and comfort him. Never go owe to feel love again. He'll never get, got to feel love again, for, even for a short amount of time. When everyone leaves and you head up to bed, this thought is firmly planted in your mind. You stay awake for a while, sitting in the darkness. It seems as though your room is getting dark, darker, and yet darker. But soon you drift off to sleep and have a dream. Why? Why did you change the timeline, Frisk? I never got to meet you! I never get uh, comfort. I never get to feel love again. And now I'm stuck as a flower forever and never ever feel a thing ever again. Please, Frisk, you gotta help me. I... I'm so alone, Frisk. I'm so afraid, Frisk. Help me. Please help me. Phew, it was just a dream. But now you know what to, you need to do. You need to go tell your Elphys what happened. Hopefully she'll be able to come up with something and everything will go back to normal. Oh, good morning, Frisk. What? What's up? What? You changed the timeline yesterday? What? Significantly? Or just a little bit? Crap! There is, there is a way to fix this, though. You'll have to go back in t time. Warn your pa asked me not, not to let you use the time machine. I don't what will happen to you, though, since when you warned me, warned past, you warned past me, I'll never, pa I'll never asked past you to time travel back, and therefore you shouldn't exist at all. Gee, this is so confusing. No time to waste. Come on, let's go. You and Alphys go inside. You reach the time machine, and Alphys tells you to go in. Once you're inside, Alphys let sets a destination time for yesterday morning before she went to find you. The door slams shut. And you hear metallic clay hangs all around you. Suddenly, everything starts spinning, and soon all your fades to white. Everything stops. You're at your destination. The door opens, and you're in Alphys' lab. You exit the time machine. Whoa! Hey, Frisk! What are you doing here? What? You're from the future? Very funny, Frisk. This is impossible. Or is it? I mean, I have a time machine. How did you get here, then? A time machine? Frisk couldn't have no Oh no, I haven't made that yet. You re you really are from the future. What are, are you going doing here, here then? To te oh, tell me it worked and that I'm a genius? What? You want me to make sure no one ev ever uses the time machine? Why? It's my best invention ever. I want people to be able to use it and enjoy it. Huh? You accidentally changed the timeline? So that's what happened in movies all the time. It's basically not that bad, well, in movies anyway. Uh, you're right. I can't let the time machine get changed, timeline get changed, but I still want to use the time machine. Plus, I really want that picture. Well, okay, I'll make sure I'll never, I'll never get the, thanks for warning me. But wait, if no one gets it, the time machine, including you, how are you still here? You're fading away. Oh no, I don't know what to do. I can't do anything. What do I do? I guess, well, I'll make sure no one ever uses the time machine. Thanks for warning me. I'll make sure no one ever to- What? Well, well, well. You managed to fix the mistake. But still remember everything. I still remember what- And we went back- ac Went back in time. Hmm. Since everything is back to normal and everyone is unha- As happy, maybe it's time for you to go. This world is only has- one threat now, you. You have the power to reset at and tear their happiness ending again. I used to have that power too, until you came along. You know the, the great feeling able to do whatever you want? But now, what's the point? All you have to do now is kill them all. But you seem like that kind of idiot who's too scared to do that. However, if you ever feel like... Like turning them all to dust. Come back. We can work together. We can take over this world and have so much fun. Should I do it? You know what? For Upper Tail, I'm gonna do it! I'm gonna go genocide. Instead of pacifist, I'm gonna go genocide next route. So, anyway. Yeah, this is actually pretty cool. I actually like it. 
So you got its own unique little thing, it's got its own storyline, even went meta with its own game. Oh, these are all YouTubers. Okay. Just for this episode, I'm gonna go extra long, so I might have to edit this. So, anyway, let's go on to, um, reset. Welcome back. Have fun. Hee hee hee. Is this game that meta? I have to be honest, this is the game that meta? Good morning. That means I would have to go back and start killing. I know what to do. I have to go to the field where every all those monsters are and start killing. You want two XP. I'm killing now. He didn't really do much in the animation, did he? I'm gaining XP. Come on. Okay, let's check my stats. I can't check stats? I keep killing and it's not working. I, I'm level 3 actually. I'm level 4. Am I just not supposed to kill? I'm level 5! The music's changed. Oh my god, he notices the dust on me. That's big. Oh god. What if I keep doing this? What if I keep doing this? Will there be a point where I can't kill any more monsters? Oh shit, I ran into it again. LV6 right now. I'm going LV6. So I'm gonna pause this and see how far I can go. Okay, 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 guys. I, I noticed this. It does. Hold on. After this fight. Hold on, hold on. I saw something. That! It has the same thing! Holy shit! That means if I kill 10 more, I, I go to the genocide. And I'm at level 7, by the way, so we have to kill 10 more. That's okay, you got 9 left. So, to 8. Seven. Come on. We got seven left. Six. We got six left. Why am I getting excited of this? Mostly because I'm finding interesting shit in a fan game. Hold on, I gotta drink.
I wish there was a way to run fast. How many left? I, I lost count now. Three left. There are three left. Nice try, Froggit. This should be the last one. But well, we're gonna double check. It's gonna say determination, there's none left. Zero left. Okay, zero left. There's that music, and the music's no longer there. I can't go back. Hey, yeah. Uh, you've been busy, huh? I know what you did, ex that your XP has risen. So I got a question for you. Do you think even the worst person can change? No way! Even if you just try? <laughs> Alright. Here's a better question. Do you want to have a bad time? Because if you take another step forward, pal, you're really not going to have a bad next. And honestly, neither will I. Well, sorry, Tori. I didn't want to have to do this. But, sorry, this is why I don't make promises. You joined in the same process again! Look, I uh, don't pr really don't want to fight you. Why don't we just call it a... Try to fix this together. I've co come to f too far now for this timeline to get destroyed. Please, kid. ALREADY?! Oh, I was uh, honestly not expecting that. I thought you were uh, friends. But hey, I'm wrong about mo almost everything, and this is no exception, I guess. Well, I'm going to Grilby's. Why do you end it so quickly? Papyrus, do you want any- What? Sans? No! Why did you- Frisk! No, you can't be Frisk! Frisk wouldn't do this. Who are you? I demanded it! <sighs> oh no. Well, uh, I believe in you. Yes, yes, you did it! You finally get it! This is the world. It's kill or be killed. So who's next, partner? Oh my god! Why are you breaking my heart? Ugh. What's with the creepy face? What are you doing? We're going through the whole process again! No. Well done. Very, very, very well done. You're instead a greater, a great partner. You betrayed your friends with no remorse or pity. Your LVXP have increased. You are very powerful and determined. However, this version of Genocide is incomplete. I believe some sort of update is coming for this game. The update will provide a new and improved Genocide route. So therefore, everything you've just done is pointless. Which means there is no reason to keep you alive. Goodbye. Of course! Hold on. Of course we're just gonna sit here and wait now. We are waiting.
Is this just gonna be endless? Or would I have to redownload this game? Well, anyway, uh, I guess I should just end it while well, I still can, and, um, anyway, guys, um, anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Upper Tail, this, this, end, well, this, this Undertale fan game, whatever, like, this had so much shit to it that I didn't even know, like, holy shit, like, it did so much to the game that you didn't expect it to do. And, like, it had so much references to the original game, and it had so much connection, and it made more sense. It kind of made sense. It wasn't bad. It wasn't good. <laughs> it wasn't that good, but it was pretty cool. It pushed my buttons like it did in the other game, like it did Undertale did, so that's great. So, anyway, um, you, here's to you, to create it. I actually kind of like this. So, anyway, um... I'll catch you guys later, and stay nerdy, my friends. Bye-bye!